Hola, buenos dias. Good morning, my beautiful people. Welcome back to the channel. So good to see you. Thank you so much for stopping by and spending some time with me here today. As always, it's your girl here, Daniela, Miss Four Lizard. And today I thought I would um, film a, a plan with me, um, setting up a daily agenda sheet. Um, and so if you're interested in seeing how I set up a daily agenda sheet to help me organize my day, um, just keep on watching. So I actually have um, my daily agenda sheets at the very front of my planner. And this is my uh, Franken planner. I have various planners Franken planned into here. And actually, I just picked up this dashboard. This is a dry erase dashboard from the Miss Maker accessory line. I got it on clearance at Joann's. It was such a steal. And this is like such a wonderful idea for like, you know, a, a reusable daily agenda sheet. I won't be using that today though. I kind of want to work on paper, but I have this section in my, um, at the very front of my Franken planner, and I actually have this bookmark that says hourly schedule on it. And this is my daily agenda section where I just have different um, pages uh, from different, like various uh, daily sheets from the happy planner, um, or just like filler paper that can be used as like a daily agenda sheet. And this is where I go for, I go to if I need like an extra like sheet to help me organize my day. Usually I would say that I kind of stick to um, just kind of working through my planners to help me organize myself. But some days I just get really like, I just have so much going on that I just kind of need everything to be in one place. And so I set up my daily agenda sheet. And so this is an example of, um, how I used this particular um, daily page um, for work. And then usually on the back, they just have dot grid paper. This one is uh, one from the Oasis Mickey collection. And I love this format so much. This is probably my favorite type of daily agenda sheet because it gives you the hourly schedule as well as a to-do list. And um, also like different sections for various things. I wish they had like, this as a double-sided sheet so that this would be also on the back but they just give us um grid paper on the back with a little design but i like decorating them also when i have time i actually set up my own hourly schedule uh sheet on the back so that way i'm you know using um, both sides of the paper so i'm actually i think i'm going to use this uh this page right right here um, today to set up my my daily sheets for the day and this is actually from a wellness planner or just a wellness notebook from the happy planner it was the mickey and minnie uh, floral bloom planner um, the one where like it's mickey and minnie but also florals and these aren't necessarily like agenda sheets but i think that they can work for a daily agenda sheets, you know, it's it's okay to just, you know, even though it's not the the uh the format isn't necessarily what you um what it's intended to be used for, like you can definitely just go ahead and um adopt or adapt different types of pages to fit your needs. And I feel like here on this side, it's perfect for an hourly schedule or a to-do list. And then you can um, either use these boxes, how they're meant to be used and journal, or you can just use them as like um, to-do lists or something or, you know, whatever you want. So I am super like in love with this particular uh, style of paper and so I'm just I just want to use it as a daily agenda sheet as opposed to like a journaling type of um, paper so we're gonna go ahead and fill this out and I'll show you how I set up a daily agenda page to help organize my life um, so let's get into it so first of all it's Saturday and the current date is March the I believe it's the 5th let me zoom in a little bit more. And instead of journaling here, like today was, I am just going to um, 
give myself a long to-do list of all the chores that I want to get done today. And I think I'm gonna bust into this All the Essentials sticker book because I just got this and I wanna play around with it a little bit. Today's list, yeah, let's pull for this sticker here. And maybe I can just layer this over there. So today's list. And then I'm gonna pull for my uh, clean colored dot pens. I am absolutely loving these. And I'm just going to use the dot side to set up um, a to-do list here. So it is Saturday and I do like to um, try to do the absolute most on the weekends. So let's set up what I have to do today. I'm gonna pull for my trusty Micron and um, I'm gonna start off with the like order of importance of what needs to get done. So number one item that needs to get done is I need to go to the bank and deposit um, a money order. And then also I have to deposit uh, my check and withdraw money. So I'll just put like a dollar sign there. I also need to uh, cut Bugs's nails. That's my dog. I have to find like some kind of pet salon around here so that he can cut, so I can get his nails cut. He's a pug, he hates getting his nails cut, but sometimes they get so long and they start kind of scratching and hurting when he puts his paws on me. And I actually just moved um, a few months ago to a new city about 40 minutes away from where I used to live and I had my like pet salon slash groomer who I would always go to in my old neighborhood and now I've been kind of putting off finding a new groomer but I'm gonna have to do that this weekend so I want to find one and get his nails cut. I also want to print out photos. I've been kind of putting that off. Um, I like to print out photos that I've taken, you know, throughout the month to include in my scrapbook. And so have been kind of putting that off, but I need to do that. So I need to print photos. And I also um, want to do a few items for work here. Um, I just need to, um, let's see. I need to do some data analysis and I know it's the weekend, but um, sometimes it just makes sense for me to like do a couple of items on the weekend because um, sometimes the data analysis takes hours, like eight, nine hours to do. And sometimes it's very easy to just to submit, like to submit the analysis and then have it run over the weekend. So that way come Monday, I'm like at a much better spot a uh, spot like to start work. It really doesn't take me a lot to do that. So there's a couple of things that I want to push um, to push forward. So I need to like figure that out. So I'm just gonna put genomics workshop just to remind myself that I need to get a few items done. And this is where it's, I like to like look through my planners that I have and see if there's anything that I need to do. Um, so I'll just kind of flip through them. Let's see. Um, okay. I need to get some grading done. So I'm not going to try to get all the grading done, but I'll grade a few quizzes. And then let's see, what else do I have to do here? Okay, so um, there's an artwork I want to finish today. And 
for my science communication work, I want to share it on our group social media. So we'll do that. Um, let's see, my current event events section. Um, I kind of want to catch up on the news. So let's write that down. Catch up on news. So that means like listen to the radio a bit or read a few articles, maybe just one or two. And then spirituality. Um, let's see. I kind of want to work in spirituality today. So um, journal in faith planner. I want to do that today. And then let's see what else do I want to do. Fitness. Oh, and by the way, I need to update this. Um, so I did do an ab workout and I did do cardio. So let's color those. And I want to do a 15 minute stretch and an ab booty workout. So let's put that down there. Okay, so that's fitness. And then, okay, moving on to wellness. Let's see, what do I wanna do for wellness? I kinda wanna journal in my wellness planner. Um, so let's put down wellness journaling. And let's see what else. It's my bedtime routine, my farmhouse. Okay, so what do I have here? Okay, yeah, I have a couple items to do. Um, okay, so I also wanna vacuum my room. I guess it's part of tidying my room, but I want to explicitly state it so that I um, I remember to do it. So let's see, tidy room and um, let's see what else. Uh, And then for nutrition, I do kind of want to go grocery shopping today so that I have um, and like meal meal plan. So um, I'm just gonna also put household chores. And grocery shop. and uh, meal plan, which honestly meal planning probably is, I should put that before grocery shopping so that way I check it off first. And um, yeah, I think that's about it here. I also, let's see, and then, um, so that is definitely gonna be enough for today. But I have a couple of items that I would love to try to get done as well. So let me cover up that journaling prompt there at the top. Ah. I need to vacuum my room so badly. There's hair everywhere. I shed so much. So why don't we put some washi tape on there and then write, and then put down this sticker here. And then um, there's a couple of like things I wanna get done that 
pertain to like my crafting life, my planner life, and that is to um, edit um, my, what was I, edit my morning routine video that I just filmed. Hopefully I can get that done. Oh, and I also want to post um, my March uh, setup to IG. I'm trying to be better about like sharing on Instagram as well as on YouTube and just like sharing the thumbnails of my videos whenever I post videos so that way I have both platforms kind of like, uh, you know, active and so I want to post that to um, to Instagram as well as my personal Twitter and Facebook and I also want to set up um, my planner volume one which this is my volume one of my mega happy planner I have 17 planners and I have to set them all up for the following week and so I want to set up I try to set up one half on Saturday and the second half on Sunday so that way I'm kind of breaking it up so I want to set up volume one uh, planner for next week all right so I think that's all I'm gonna write down for this particular sheet this is already so much and you know I'd be happy I'd be really happy if I finished uh, if I finished everything on this list we'll see how much I get done today and I'm gonna leave these two boxes Mm, well, actually, no, I'm gonna cover this one up. So I went ahead and covered up this box with the washi tape as well because I don't think I'm gonna journal about that. I'm gonna leave this journaling uh, prompt in here because I think it'll be fun to just fill it in at the end of the day. It says, where did you see love today? I think that's kind of cute. And um, this box up here, I'm not sure what I'm gonna use it for. Pour. so I'm just gonna leave it blank for now and I currently have one of my sticker storage uh, books here that I'm just gonna flip through and see if there's anything I want to add um, to this page here just cuz I have so many stickers in this particular um, sticker storage and I want to um, I want to start using them up so we'll see. I'm try to see if anything catches my eye. Oh, I like this little teacup here. I think that's really cute. Maybe I'll put this here. for my bandeau stickers these I got from Barnes and Nobles and I like how they're kind of color they're in this color coordination style and I really want to pull for these stickers here um, so that's so cute water the plants I actually don't need to water the plants because it rained uh, it rained um, this morning so let's see maybe this face this face is really cool very cute I love it so much um, yeah I just I adore this already I'm gonna put this little candle here at the bottom and then <laughs> what is this Should I leave it like that? Maybe just another happy face. Like that. Maybe 
be a flower. Okay, I'm going crazy. This is what happens. I mean... Okay, that's enough. I'm done. I'm done. Step away from the stickers. Put the stickers down. Okay, so that is an example of a daily agenda sheet. Um, for me, this is very much something I would do over the weekend where it's just like a long to-do list like this and I pull for a bunch of stickers to decorate and yeah so here on my maybe I'll write an affirmation maybe I'll just write something that came up during the day and then um, here I, I'll journal about you know where did I see love today I think that's really cute I really like how this turned out and on the back we have um, uh, just like the same exact format, but in just different colors and just slightly different. So I really like these wellness um, pages that are meant for journaling as daily agenda sheets. I think you can definitely use and repurpose uh, formats to fit what you need. Like I picked up this um, wellness journal because I saw the potential that it had as a daily agenda sheet. And I think actually the journal, the wellness journals have amazing um, formats and that you can definitely repurpose them to be a daily agenda sheet. And I actually also use these pages sometimes as journaling, uh, as daily agenda pages. So this is another style of wellness journaling pages from the Happy Planner. This one was from the Color Block uh, wellness journal. Uh, and I, I think like the different sections and everything I use like, uh, I kind of change it to fit my needs, obviously, but I also leave a couple of things in as well. Um, just like the today's mood, I think that's fun, so I leave that in, but then I'll set up my schedule and my to-do list for the day and not necessarily use it as journaling, um, as journaling pages. So I think this one turned out really well. It's perfect. It's just like a long to-do list, a couple of sections. It's really cute. I'm gonna look forward to, you know, checking things off this list. And I think it would be fun to check in tomorrow morning to see how, you know, I finished up filling out this page. I think it looks super cute. So, you know, I never do that. I never like check in after some time to show you like after the pen. So we'll do that this time around. So if you're interested in seeing, you know, how I actually um, filled this out and how much I got done today, um, just stay tuned and I will see you tomorrow. Hola, I'm back. So it's the next day, it's Sunday morning. I just filmed this uh, yesterday, Saturday, and I said that I would come back on here um, in the morning the next day to show you all uh, the after the pen of my daily agenda sheet. Let me see if I can zoom in a bit. This is the after the pen of this spread. I did get to um, about half of the items on my to-do list. I had an unexpected phone call uh, in the middle of the day, and so I ended up having a little bit less time than I initially thought I had. And then also just a couple other things came up. Um, I was gonna deposit this money order, but it turns out that the bank that I was gonna go to um, closed, I don't know why. And so I could have gone to another bank, but um, I had to get back to my house because I was meeting someone in the afternoon and they ended up canceling. So it actually didn't even work out. I was so upset about that, but it is what it is. But I did manage to get a couple of items done here. I didn't manage to grade or color uh, this um, drawing that I've been trying to finish or post it on Instagram. Neither was I able to catch up on the news or journal and I didn't get to my workouts, um, which I was kind of upset about too, <laughs> but it is what it is, it happens. I did do some journaling and I did tidy my room and I did meal plan and grocery shop, which were really important. I'm glad I got those done. And for household chores, I did do a couple of things, but I definitely didn't do everything that I needed to do. So I didn't check that off because I wanted to finish everything that I needed to do. But I did manage to hit all three of my crafting goals here, editing videos, uh, posting on Instagram, setting up my mega planner for the following week. And then I did journal a little bit here. I thought that was fun. I did my little digital detox. I made a fire in the fireplace in my house. It was really chilly yesterday, so it was a perfect time to do that. And I just read by the fire a little bit. I just have some notes here. Um, 
And yeah, so that is after the pen and it's Sunday. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna get to all of the items here that I wasn't able to get to yesterday. And I'm also going to give myself a couple of new items. Not that many though, because I do need to finish up these over here. But I do wanna hit a couple of things here. So I'm gonna go ahead and set this up, but I'm not gonna do that on camera. Um, I already you know, set this page up with you all. But now I'm just going to keep this page, check these off as I get them done today. And also I have a couple of new goals um, today that I want to uh, make. And I think I'm definitely gonna have a lot more time today because yesterday I was filming um, for a couple of hours and also I uh, hung out with my partner for a few hours in the evening. So I didn't have a lot of time yesterday, but today I'm a pre it's a pretty open day. I do have dinner with my family later, but other than that, I'm pretty free. So I'm gonna be able to get a couple of things done today. And yeah, I'm really happy with how this turned out, this page. I'm so happy I picked up this, um, this uh, Mickey Mouse floral wellness journal because I think the pages are so perfect for daily agenda sheets. So um, yeah, thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you in my next video. Bye.